I've been spending these first days of the year drawing a lot. In fact, I've been drawing so much, my pens are running out of ink. So I'm stopping by the art store to get some new ones. But of course I got distracted looking at all the silly things around me. I got my usual three colors and two new ones to spice things up. I'm not the type to make new year resolutions, but this year started and I felt a new energy around me. There's a new will to live, to create, to experience new things. There's a lot of stuff I want to accomplish this year, not only in my career, but in life in general. I want to go out more, explore new places, meet new people. I spend a lot of time drawing alone in my room and that can stop me from being more social and open. I have this crazy desire to step out of my comfort zone and change some habits that keep me from truly living. Don't get me wrong, I love spending time by myself, creating art. It can be very therapeutic and it helps me remain sane, but I need to go out. I went to college in Lisbon. Being in a big city allowed me to visit museums and galleries very often. I lived in a different environment with a different rhythm for three years. That was always something new to see and experience. I was surrounded by artists, we shared our work and point of views with each other. Those were the days I felt truly inspired. When I graduated and came back home, I lost all of that. Then the pandemic happened and I got stuck here. I often fear I lost a piece of me during those dark days. I want to go out into the world and find that piece I lost. One thing I have planned for this year is to travel somewhere I've never been before, all by myself, and just draw. Let these new places inspire me and see what happens. I already have some cities in mind and I might do it very soon. I decided I would start slowly, so I've been doing this drawing exercise where I go somewhere new, and when I get home I grab my sketchbook and draw whatever I remember from that place. So far I've been to two restaurants with unique decor and incredible food. Even though the drawings are just quick silly little sketches, looking at them always brings me joy and makes me want to go out more. Using my sketchbook as a journal to keep record of my efforts of being more open is a way of me telling myself how proud I am of me for trying new things and that has a very positive impact on my mental health. January has been really cold. I'm looking forward for better weather so I can take my sketchbook outside more often. In the meantime, I'll be drawing from home, but I promise exciting new things are coming and I'm bringing you along with me. I wanted to see how well the five colors work together, so I decided to draw some football players. I'm a big fan of football. My favorite team is currently playing on the second league, so the games aren't always on TV. I often rely on radio streams to keep up. And I need to keep myself busy while listening so I don't get too nervous. So I usually sit down and draw at the same time. I think the colors complement each other very well, I'm really happy with this page. This sketchbook is so big, it barely fits the frame, I'm slowly starting to realize it's going to be hell to film a tour of this sketchbook. But this is how it looks so far, it has some empty spots here and there, but I will fill them eventually.
I ran home after work just to stop by the music store and buy this. I love the feeling of buying a brand new record and listening to it for the first time from start to finish. It's such an incredible experience, I feel very fortunate to be able to collect music in this format. And I was so excited for this one, I forgot to pre-order it because I was under so much stress because of work, but I still managed to get the red version I wanted, it comes with a poster, but I forgot to film it. Before I go with some footage from New Year's Eve, I really wanted to go out but everything got cancelled because of the bad weather, so I just stayed home and did a little drink and draw all by myself. I hope this year treats us all very well, we deserve it. Share your new year resolutions with me in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye!